Good morning, my name is Samuel, and I was scheduled for a job interview today. Good morning, Samuel. I am the person in charge of interviewing new candidates, Mr. Parker. Oh, nice to meet you, Mr. Parker. The secretary said it was going to be an online interview. Yes, that's right. We need people who can do home office, so the interview will be this way. I think that's great. I have experience working online, also in this job position. Excellent. So, can we start with the interview then? It will be just some questions. Sure, and don't worry, I have plenty of time and I'm really interested. Great, let's start with... How did you know about this job opportunity? Well, I first watched it on the internet and then I called a friend who also works there in the company. Oh, so you saw our post on our social network. Okay. And what is your friend's name? His name is Robert Campbell. He's working in the informatic area in the Northeast office. All right. Now, I want you to tell me a little about yourself, your family, life, and so on. Well, as I told you before, my name is Samuel Brighton and I'm 30 years old. I was born in New York, but my family moved to London when I was 10 years old. I studied in St. Patrick Elementary School and also the high school at Petit High School. When I finished the school, I decided I wanted to be a computer programmer, so I studied to apply. One year later, I applied to London University and I studied computer programming for six years. I specialized in software and computer programs. I graduated with honors, being the first in my class. I worked for different companies as a computer programmer, so I have a lot of experience on this. I have also worked from home since the pandemic started some years ago, so I'm able to do it. About myself, I like creating computer programs and also apps for different companies. I consider myself as a responsible and very flexible person, also very curious about technology. What else can I tell you? I'm really looking forward to work with you because it is a great company. Great. Why did you exactly want to work in this company? Is there any special reason? As I already told you, I always wanted to work here since I know this is the best company. Well, People usually say that, but I'm looking for a more specific answer. What do you know about us? Well, I know you work with the best companies around the world, helping them very well. That's true. Here in X Enterprise, we work with very important brands. That's why I am excited to get this job, because I feel qualified to help you grow this company. Okay, and now, tell me about your work experience. Where have you worked so far these years? Well, I worked for a local programming companies and also for PXF Enterprise last year. Wow, PXF Enterprise. That's one of our competitors in the tech industry. Yeah, well, 
I was recommended by the supervisor who also was my teacher at college. And what were your duties in this company? What did you use to do every day? Well, I was in charge of selecting the best programs to work with and also developing. Great! And do you think it was difficult or easy to perform these tasks? How did you see it? As many other things, it was hard at the beginning, but then you learn a lot. Alright, and what is the greatest achievement you had in this position? Well, I helped getting one of the greatest contracts of the area. I created the program. That's great. And what was the worst part of working there? Or what didn't you like? I liked almost everything, except the cafeteria. <laughs> Not very good food. <laughs> I see. Well, here you won't have this problem, since we have a variation of this. That's what I've heard. Well, except that, everything was amazing. I have learned a lot. I suppose so. Now, was there any difficult situation you had to face there? Actually, there was a time when we were working a lot and we usually got stressed. That's normal in this industry since we have to stay on the computer for many hours a day. Yeah, I mean, I like programming, but it can be stressing sometimes. You know that. Of course, don't worry, but Tell me about a time you demonstrated leadership skills. About the contract I told you. I had to lead that project. So it was thanks to me we succeeded. I see. Now, what do you consider to be your weaknesses? I think my greatest weakness is I can be very impatient sometimes. That's it. What do you mean impatient? So you can lose control of things or something like that? No, no, I mean impatient because I want things to be ready really fast. Oh, I see. But sometimes when you hurry something, you can get less quality results. Yeah, I know that. That's why I try to do it very well and fast. But it can be always possible. Okay. And what are your greatest strengths? Something to be proud of? I think I am very sociable and that helps me a lot because I can get a lot of help from people. Alright, but in our industry, how can that help if we usually work alone? Oh, when I have some problems and I need advices, I have many friends to ask about. Oh, I see. Tell me about a challenge or conflict you faced at work and how do you deal with it? Let's see, okay, once I had to deliver a project, and I didn't make it on time. So, I had to contact the customer to explain them directly what had happened. I told them I was improving their program, of course that was true, I was doing it. And I convinced them to reschedule the meeting. They did. So we got that contract. My direct boss congratulated me 
and I was named the employee of the month. Wow, that's a good story. And now tell me a time you failed at doing something. Oh, it happened to me just once. We couldn't finish a project because it was too difficult. Okay, and how did you feel about that? What did you do about it? That was the only time we couldn't make anything. I felt terrible for like a month. Yeah, I suppose so. And have you ever been fired from any job before? Or never? Happily, it never happened. Always quit because of a better job opportunity. Alright, what are your career aspirations? Your plans for the future? My plan is to learn as much as possible, to be the best programmer in five years. That's a good plan. Well, do you have any questions for us? Anything you'd like to know? Yeah, I have some questions. I want to know about the payment, shifts, and so on. Oh, that information will be given in the second part of the interview. It will be the next week, okay? Alright, I'll be waiting for that then. I really want to work with you in a great company. Don't worry, you did it well. So just wait for the email with the date and the confirmation. Thank you very much. Have a great day and excellent week, sir. I hope you really liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more with this video, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. I'll see you in the next video. Oh, if you have any idea for a next video, just write it in the comments. Take care.